Hi everyone. Um, for those that'll see it now, I didn't post anything last night because I was so exhausted. Um, yeah, it was really exhausting obviously going, doing everything yesterday and then taking everything to the Bahamas. Um, so we landed in Nassau pretty late. Uh, there were quite a, I mean, there's so, so much air traffic there at the moment. Um, yeah, we walked in, we went through customs, um, and then we took all the medical stuff, to, we separated it, and took it to two different places. Um, one section went to the local hospital there in Nassau, which has almost reached its full capacity. Um, and then the rest are going to Treasure K today. Um, they should have probably already left from there. But um, the big thing which was incredible is that there was uh, there's, there's a triage there, um, obviously with respect to them I wasn't going to take a video of what was going on, but um, there's a triage with a group of nurses, um, must be about 20 nurses, they are getting all the information they need to, to um, distribute accordingly. Um, we spoke to the right people of course to make sure that everything is going, so this stuff is personally delivered to the people in need with the medical personnel that we went down with um, and that's in conjunction with Acute Air. It's a very small business, private business. Um, they've been receiving funding from obviously the, the GoFundMe um, and uh, private uh, donators which have, they've been fantastic. So um, I think the big thing that people forget is that it's, it's now that they need it the most because there are people there that have been there for about three or four days that haven't received anything. Um, it's it's really bad, and um, unfortunately, and I don't know what I what I am, and I'm not allowed to say, but it is worse than the TV makes it worse than the news makes it out to be. Um, obviously, they don't want anyone to panic, so it's really bad. Um, and again, I think it's just a matter of getting now that they, they've opened the Grand Bahama Bay. Old, it's, it's Grand Bahama Bay, it's a West End. They've opened that for boats. Um, they have opened um, the airport there for any planes under 20 tons. So if you guys, again, have anyone around that, I mean, we accept UPS as well. There's so, there's so much, and thank you to everyone. We've received so much. Um, when we asked the nurses what exactly they would want us to bring, because the planes are fairly small, so we can only carry a certain amount of weight, they said that they need everything. It's not even a matter of one thing or the other, or anything particular, they, they, they need everything. So it was, it was um, quite an experience to go there um, to see what was going on for myself. And again, I, I've done it to, to let everyone know that I know that the stuff that we are getting is reaching the right places because obviously we get told um, a lot of things and people are very skeptical um, so thank you again to everyone um, I am on my way to New York at the moment um, a quick call they have asked us myself and Ben to do watch what happens live so we will be on watch what happens live on Monday um, it's gonna be quite funny Ben is the most eccentric guy I've ever met in my life so I hope it's a laugh um, but again, thank you to all the support. Thank you for everyone. Um, it's it's not a matter of doing this for any other reason, but um, just just to help. You know, um, I'm, I've never been to the Bahamas. Yesterday was my first time to the Bahamas, and I wish, obviously, that I had spent some time there before. I hear of everyone saying, um, you know, they they were going to go and they didn't, and they wish they had. Um, yeah, I guess it's uh, the awareness of it, like people need to still understand that now is when people need the most help. So if you know of anyone that can deliver any sort of items to uh, any of the designated points, we'd be very, very appreciative of that. Um, and again, just it's just a matter of moral support for those who, who are in need. I've, I've received some messages, um, very unfortunately, of some families. Um, that have lost uh, their loved ones in in this situation at the moment. Um, so prayers obviously go out to them. And yeah, I, again, it's just a matter of a matter of making 
you know, I, I, I keep telling everyone it's what what use is a social media platform except for something like this. Um, I don't see any other need for it. So um, please, guys, if you can, um, donate to the GoFundMe. And literally, if it's five bucks, if it's ten bucks, it's going to, you know, a really, really good cause. Um, and if you do have stuff to deliver, this stuff will be used regardless, whether it's today, whether it's tomorrow, it's all going to go to the Bahamas. Um, I know that the obviously with the news um, and following the hurricane, the light has taken away um, and the news show the immediate effects of the hurricane. But in going to Nassau yesterday and seeing how desperate people are for this stuff and again speaking to the right people about what exactly is going on the news aren't even covering what it is going on so again just if, if we could just get everything that we can to these places not just myself but everyone is trying to help out it is all going to the Bahamas and it's going for a good cause once we start getting really big boats um, out there it would be fantastic but you know if someone gets 10 planes out there and one person gets one plane that's 11 planes so it doesn't matter how big or how small the organization is or the community we just want to get as many people out there anyway, thanks guys take care and uh, we'll see you on what happens live on monday cheers I am going to be on my way to there to Bahamas now uh, to personally see that our stuff is going to the right place. And uh, Ben, thank you very much for the eggs. That'll be all that I eat today. <laughs> Cheers, guys. So I'm going to be leaving with this uh, group and I'll keep you guys updated. Apparently it's not a very pretty sight. So um, yeah, but I'll keep you updated. I'd like to be on the field to see where the stuff is actually going and how we're distributing it. So keep a look up. After hearing of our president's death in Zimbabwe, I have found the nearest pub. Grab myself a Guinness and a shot of Jamison. Cheers. Working very hard uh, to get all this stuff out now that we've got, uh, medical supplies of course, here's my mate Ben um, and the planes that we are going to be delivering to Bahamas. I am going to go to the Bahamas myself, I want to see that this person we get to. That was well needed and well earned, thank you Robert Mugabe. So we're currently at NASA airport, just uh, clearing through customs with all the medical supplies that we have that you guys have made a plan to bring to us. Thank you so much again. I'll keep you updated.